Here with senior Katrina Muther after a 2-1 victory over Doan in the quarterfinals of the GPAC tournament. Just talk first about defensively. Uh, Doan's one of the top offensive teams in the conference, and you came real close to, to shutting them out uh, a week after coming close to shutting Hastings out. Uh, how have you been able to, to be so successful in the back? Um, well, on the back, we really try to um, keep them in front of us, um, contain them kind of so they don't get behind us because that's when issues happen. And um, we've been trying to eliminate the number of set pieces, like corners and free kicks that the other team gets because um, you can mark up all day, but sometimes they just, you know, get the ball. They just head the ball over your head. So we just try and um, do our best to mark up and eliminate those chances that we give them. How about the, the role that this team has got on now win number 13 and three in a row? Uh, I mean, what's it like uh, being part of this team right now? Um, it's it's really awesome because especially as seniors, like we've come so far and a lot of us never pictured us in this place, but I think that our team has a really good head on its shoulders. Um, we know that every game we have to take well, take every game one at a time, and um, we like to celebrate what we've done, but also remember that each day is um, new and comes with new um, trials and new opportunities, so we just try and keep our heads. Now we'll see either Midland or Dakota Wesleyan here on Saturday. How exciting is that to be able to host now in the semifinals, too? Yeah, that's really exciting. We've never done it, obviously. So, um, and it's we had an awesome fan base today. So, thank you, thank you to everyone who came out. Um, and that's a really big advantage for us too, playing on turf, playing at home. Um, so, we're really excited and looking forward to that game.